In a major clash, Balochistan Liberation Army attacked two posts in Pakistan's southwest province of Balochistan, neutralizing more than 100 Pakistani personnel. The attacks destroyed a large part of Pak's paramilitary post in Panchgur town, about 450 kilometers south of the provincial capital, Quetta and another one in Noshki, about 330 kilometers north of Panjgur. Three to four blasts were reported. In an official statement, BLA said the major parts of both the camps were under their control and Baloch Fidais have so far killed more than 100 enemy personnel. Pakistan, to misguide its citizens and spread misinformation, has banned its media from reporting events. It has reportedly disconnected all telecommunication networks in the region. BLA in its statement said, Pakistan military's ISPR is claiming today's attack was repulsed. This is a complete lie and BLA's today's operations are still underway with full intensity. Pak's military media wing, Inter-Services Public Relations, Pakistan's Interior Minister Sheikh Rashid Ahmed, also downplaying the intensity of the attack, declared that only four soldiers were killed. Pak PM Imran Khan on the attacks tweeted, The nation stands united behind our security forces who continue to give great sacrifices to protect us. Balochistan is the largest, least populous and poorest province in Pakistan. Baloch fighters target security forces demanding their rights and independence for ethnic Baloch areas of the province. The Panjgur and Noshki attacks are also being viewed as a message to Beijing. The local Balochs do not approve of Beijing's Belt and Road Initiative in the region, whose benefits never reach them. BLA's attack comes a day before the opening ceremony of Beijing Winter Olympics where Pakistan PM Imran Khan is scheduled to meet Chinese President Xi Jinping.